Welcome to this prayer. This is a prayer I put together where I'd like to pray for anyone within the sound of my voice. All I ask you to do is to agree with me as I pray, and together we will seek our Heavenly Father. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we gather together and come into agreement in the wonderful and powerful name of Jesus Christ. Where two or more gathered, there you'll be in the midst of us, and anything we agree upon is touching, you will surely do. Father, in Jesus' name, there's no distance in the Spirit, and we thank you for the person I'm praying for who desires this prayer to you. Father, they want to please you in all that they do. They want to serve you authentically. They want to be a genuine believer. Holy Spirit, please open their eyes and show them if there's any area of their life that they should be using to help other people. Help them see the need. Generosity is who you are. You love people so much that you sent your only son to take their place in order to make a way for your family to grow. We speak an increase over their life so that they can give more to people. You have blessed them with things so that they can be a steward and share it with others. Show them where, how, and to whom this needs to happen in Jesus' name. They are your hands in this world. Reveal to the person I'm praying for who to extend their hand to. We decree and declare that generosity is rising from within them, and as they faithfully give to others, you are pouring out abundance and increase in their life. As they are faithful to give what they have, you will trust them with even more. Thank you that as their generosity is administered, it brings glory and honor to you. Continue to use them to touch the lives of other people with hope in this dark world. They are a shining example of your love. Help them to communicate your love in a way that is crystal clear and cannot be misinterpreted. You hear this prayer. You are meeting the needs of people through the person I am praying for. Grant them discernment to even more clearly hear your voice. Guide them throughout their day. Thank you for continuing to show them what you want them to do in order to be a blessing to others. They are not entangled in the cares of this world. They are not distracted and crippled by the strategies of the enemy. They are not wrapped up in their own life. When you bring opportunity after opportunity to minister to people through them, they will be quick to obey in order to bring you the honor you so rightly deserve. As a result, you will reward them with more and more blessings for not only themselves, but again, for others. Rinse and repeat. Hallelujah. We believe and receive everything we've prayed and give you glory in advance, for this prayer is answered. In the wonderful and precious name of Jesus we pray. Amen.